Lisa. Thanks for joining me today. Today I want to share with you a product from scrapbook.com. It is a brand new product for your craft organization. This is called the Tall Skinny Stadium Organizer. It was recently released at scrapbook.com and it does have three compartments as you see here and I just want to go through and show you all kinds of fun things that you can store in this organizer. If you have any of their Craft Room Basics organizers, the material is very similar. So this is made of heavy duty four millimeter ultra thick gray board and it's wrapped in a sturdy white glossy paper. So you can see it does have that glossy finish and it's very sturdy. So you can hear that. And I actually have another one of their organizers that I recently showed on my channel and I will show you how it compares to that at the end of this video. So this organizer, it's 5.2 inches wide. So from here to here, it's about 5.2 inches. So from here to here is about four inches. And then in the back, it's about seven inches. So this is actually perfect for any of your slimline paper pads, your slimline dies, because these back compartments are so deep that they will hold all of those tall, skinny slimline dies and paper pads. Now I wanna show you something else that's useful about this, is it actually comes with these two inserts. So notice they're two different sizes, and these just drop right in to the centers of these compartments. So if you wanted to have all of this space, maybe you had a really, really tall die or some type of tall tool that you wanted to store in here, you can take this out. But if you needed less space, you can just pop this right in and it will sink all the way to the bottom and then you can have less space and not go so deep. So if you had a shorter tool or something else that's shorter, you can then put in here using the insert. You also have another one and you can pop that right into the middle compartment and it just slides right in and you can take them in and out as needed depending on what you are storing in your compartment. Okay, so let's take a look at what we can store in this organizer. Here are some of the scrapbook.com slimline dies. And I have them in the scrapbook.com slimline envelopes. So all of my dies are organized in here and these dies fit perfectly in this storage container. I also have some standard size traveler's notebooks and these fit in this organizer as well. So you can pop those in there and you can see they are fit perfectly in there. I also have several of the scrapbook.com slimline sized paper pads. And these paper pads, you can see they are perfect for your slimline cards. So you can see how they are tall and skinny. And I can pop these in here as well. So we'll go into this middle section. And you can fit quite a bit in here. Now these paper pads, I don't even think have rarely been used. So I'm gonna see how many I can get in here. So here I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight paper pads that are stored in this second compartment. Even the small paper pads that are four and a quarter by five and a half, those would fit in here as well. You can also store your stamps in here. So we can pop our stamps in there. You can also, if you're a scrapbooker, you might have these four by six sheets and those will also fit in there. Now the smaller ones are a little small. You can definitely put them in here, but they're not gonna show up over top of the edge here. So they will sit down further below. Now, if you wanted to use maybe one of the smaller components back here and pop that in here and then stick it in, it would then give you some height there. And if you needed some marker storage, you can also fit your markers in here. I'm gonna go ahead and take these out. So markers would fit nicely in here as well. And you can get a whole bunch of markers in this organizer. If you wanted to store all of your markers in here, maybe you had a lot of them, you can use this all just for marker storage. So this is the one I recently showed on my channel. And this one is one that scrapbook.com has had out for a while now. 
It is called the Craft Room Basics Desktop Stadium Organizer. And this one measures seven and a half inches wide and it's 10 and a half inches deep. And it has four compartments. It has a taller one in the back and you have your middle and your front two made of the same material as the previous one that I showed you. So let's take a look at what you can store in this organizer. I have a traveler's notebook, so traveler's notebooks will fit. I also have some sticker books, so the sticker books will fit in here as well. And I also have just some sheets of some alphabet stickers. If you have any of those six by eight paper pads by Simple Stories, like I have here, these will fit in here. So I have some pages, or you can store the whole paper pad in here. You also can store your six by six paper pads. So if you needed paper pad storage for your six by six paper pads, you definitely can fit a whole bunch of paper pads in here. And if you needed storage for your stamps, you can fit stamps in here. And then I also have these pocket cards. So if you do scrapbooking or traveler's notebooks, um, pocket scrapbooking, you can definitely store your pocket cards in these front components. And the nice thing about this particular organizer is that you can actually see these cards and you can just flip through them and see what you have. You can also use these front compartments if you had ephemera and you wanted to sort your ephemera as you're working on a project, you can put your ephemera in here and keep it sorted while you're working on your cards or your scrapbooking. So I just wanna show you these side by side so just so you can see the difference. So you can see that the tall and skinny one is in fact tall and skinny, so it's more narrow, whereas this one is wider and it will fit in those wider papers, those wider sticker books, and so on and so forth. And then if we turn this this way, this will give you a better idea. You can kind of see the difference in the height. So overall, just like the rest of scrapbook.com's Craft Room Basic collection, they are made of the same material so that if you had several of them that you wanted to display on your craft desk, these would all look really nice and uniform. So I will have links to these products down below in case you're interested in purchasing them. And let me know if you have any questions. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day. Bye-bye.